Hello, this is Norman Kier, and welcome to another Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild video. I've taken like a shorter break than usual. I uh, did not record a video yesterday or maybe perhaps the day after yesterday. I don't really remember how long it's been since my last video. Maybe like two days now. Well, anyways, I'm making another Zelda video. And I'm not going to make this one too long. I'm going to make it under 15 minutes. That way it won't take. Last time I did the last video that I did of the Zelda series took around, I think it took nine hours to upload just for an extra few minutes added to the 15. So, yeah. And I'm over here because I killed all the goblins and stuff right over here next to all of these hopefully dead um i don't remember what they're called wait is this one alive there's also still no sound i have no idea how to fix that it's just oh wait there's goblins Oh, wait, no, I did not do a flurry. Okay. I don't know what I'm going to be doing for this video. Okay. These got the, the orange guys, orange or red. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Okay, this one seems to be already tamed. All right, then, let's just go. You, oh, thank goodness I did not run over the those, uh, or I almost called the bird goblins. What are, they, what are those orange things even really called? Wait, wait, why did I even go for the horse anyways? Because I, I don't exactly know where this is. I think this is towards the mountains because it's very rocky here and <coughs> it's... Volcanoes are rockier, at least in this game. Oh, well, I mean, they are in real life anyways, but... Okay, I think I might break this, trying to get these. Yep. Wait, did I even... You know, I think I could have used that horse. Yeah, I think it might be, like, ten times faster with the horse. Okay, I gotta look at a map where I'm heading, because if I go down here, it'll go up into here. So then I'll be following the path to here. Where's this lead in the end? Okay, because I'm pretty far away from the Korok village. So if I head onto this path right over here, then it'll lead me all the way over here to the Hatno village. Okay, but where are the mountains? Are they like here? Ish, maybe this is like the Hyrule Castle so that means it's got to be like around here but I'm just gonna follow the path I'll find a few things maybe or I mean wait so if I go this way I don't know exactly where it would lead me if I went the opposite okay yeah I don't know where I'm on on the map but it looks like these rocky mountains will lead to the. Does it read? Does it lead to the uh, Kuraku village? I don't know. It's down here. Is it the desert? I believe I've already been down inside the desert. Yep. So. I think I'm gonna get. I think I'm gonna travel over here. Sorry, I'm abandoning the horse. Goodbye, horse. I wonder what it, I wonder what the teleporting thing looks like from the horse's point of view. But we've done eight shrines. I got zero orb things. Got three core op things. And yeah, that this is not. This is like the fortieth episode, and we have not made a lot of progress at all. Where's my horse? Yeah, here's the volcano area. Uh, 
I don't know if the current will allow me to go to my horse. I think I should have planned this a little bit better. If I do this, it will take a heart out, but will it put me to the shrine? Yeah, I think it will put me. How am I supposed to get out then? Uh, I can do this. It's raining now. Okay, I was about to say, did that affect? Okay. Okay. Let's see here, I gotta get them close enough. No! Oh, the rain makes it so annoying. Oh no, I made that too far away. Cause now it's gonna put me, I'm not gonna slip for some reason. My horse is just waiting there. I think I can just swim all the way back here. All right then, we're heading towards the mountains. All right then, let's go. Oh wait, this is water. Okay, uh, if I go through this way, where are the Rocky Mountains? Well anyway, it'll get me closer. Don't have much food at all and I got two hearts. So, I'm gonna have, probably have to go hunting yeah, I can just eat mushrooms and stuff. I got like a few items like this, this hardy radish, which if I'm pretty sure if I cook it will give me like eight extra hearts, but don't really need that because I only have four hearts. Which I have made progress because I used to have three, but now I only have four and you need 13 to get the Master Sword. Maybe 13 or 14, I don't know. Wait, this is the worst time to climb the mountain. Uh, yep. I should probably do some Divine Beasts as well. And the armor selection that I have is not good. If I see any apples and stuff on trees, I should probably pick them. Oh wait, I just stopped. Okay. I'm gonna be climbing up here. <clears throat> It's gonna start getting hotter and hotter. I don't know if I have like a cold sword or something like that. I don't think I do. I do have clothes, these clothes things that might keep the heat. They might, yeah. I think, I think these will make me less hot but the temperatures on the volcano are just too intense that Compared to the desert, like, it's just. Wait, I could have brought my horse, but, oh. The horse can come here. Is it coming? No, it looks like uh, he or she is gone. Seems used to, yeah, I guess YouTube got stuck. Uh, let's just see here. Wait, don't I have the Where's the pants? Okay. Wait, isn't that? Okay. So I think, I don't know if I can burn it. I'm not gonna burn it easily from this, but I'm still gonna burn. But I think I might be able to get closer to the volcano and not take less damage. I have no fire resistance, I don't think. So that would be, that would show up in this. That's the only food I have. So, I think I'm gonna have to do it. I'm so sorry. Let's see, I gotta get the meat. Raw bird thigh, all right. So I need to cook that, which when I really need it, I think I have enough resources, I might need to cut down a tree it's just I don't have an axe so yep I think I can cut it down with the sword okay I'm actually starting to get pretty close oh wow I think isn't that the smoke from the volcano 
Okay, yeah. <clears throat> it's starting to get hotter. There's a shrine nearby, which would be really handy to find. <clears throat> Seems to be getting quieter. Or maybe, like, a little bit more. Yeah, it's somewhere here. No? This direction? No? Perhaps I can get a better view. Uh, seems like it's kind of more down here-ish, but, you know, just like a few more minutes of climbing. And perhaps it's right over here, actually. Seems to, no? Is it not here? Just stopped. Okay. Well, it's a pretty good view from up here. So I need, I think I should be able to spot a lot of the shrines. Alright. I can see a lot of the towers. I can see to the very, very uh, edge of the world. Oh, wait. It's 7.35 now. It's almost night time. There's the divine beast. And there's the castle. Uh, oh wait, I'm climbing. I thought I was walking up the thing. So, yeah, I don't know with my stamina that I have if I will be able to do this, but one good thing about this game is that you can defeat Ganon with three hearts. You can do anything with the beginner and stuff. You just have to find another way. You have to be creative with the stuff that you have. But, like, I'm pretty sure that should be possible. Like, with this, it's just, just going to be a lot more challenging without Rivali's Gale, which you get from the Flying Divine Beast. There's the Lost, there's the lost Woods, which I might want to try to... Oh, wow. Oh, here's a memory. <coughs> Very beautiful game. Okay, picture looks the same. Now Link realizes that something happened. Okay then, that cut doesn't look too bad actually. But you know, there's a fine line between courage and recklessness. As brave as you are, that does not make you immortal. Wow. Seems like that, not only if frequently of these types of attacks on the rise, but the scale of beast we are facing is intense the, of the fall. I fear that. I fear that this is the omen which portends the return of Ganon. And if that's the case, I'm ready to expect the worst. We'll need to make preparations as soon ASAP. Okay then. So, captured memories, all right then. I don't know what it happens when you capture all of the memories, but. Okay. There's a bad guy there. I wonder what would happen if I put on my good clothes. Okay, nothing. So if I had any icy arrows, which I do not. There we go. Got a damage piece. Okay, I broke my uh, weapon, but now I can get another one. Wait, now the boomerang is? Oh no, this is really bad. Okay. Oh. Oh God, I'm about to die. Okay, okay, okay. 
Okay, 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 okay. Um, 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 um. I did not mean to do that. I did not mean to press the, the, the B button. Usually that's A on Xbox, and I've been playing Xbox a lot. Mm. I guess I should not do that at night. I think a thing I could do to uh, <clears throat> solve that is wait out the time, maybe. Because the lizard's all the way over there, so. Maybe perhaps if I, I think I have flint, just wood on the other hand. Do acorns count? I don't think so. Yeah, I have flint, but. Okay, what if I just avoid them? What's this? Nope, nothing. Okay. Well, there's some more of those turkey things. But it's getting kind of. It's getting a lot more hot here. With these clothes, I think I should be able to survive. Like, I don't think I can go. Oh! Yeah. Okay. Put on good clothes. And I guess I'll shoot them. Right in the head. There we go. Okay, I gotta be more careful though. Oh wow, no, no wonder that did so much damage. Oh wow. That was, oh wow, a 45? That's the most powerful weapon I've had so far. Okay, no wonder that destroyed my four hearts. I wasted some food. Now I don't have any more food. Okay, it's starting to get a little bit too hot for these clothes. So I'm going to have to put on the Gerudo clothes. So, now then, I'm basically in like the heart. Okay, yeah. If I could find some of those lizards I just saw. Yeah, I think that's too hot for me. Well, it's too bad. This is the barrier I can go. Okay. Oh, wow, the video is 17 minutes long. Oh, forget about it. I'm going to make it 23. Okay. Did not realize. Okay, maybe perhaps I can come up here and then, you know. Oh, wait, do I even have enough rubies to... Okay. I think what my plan is is to jump up here. Also probably uh this video will be released tomorrow right now it's for me it's may 17th so if it's if this comes out may 18th you can understand why because you know it's kind of late and it takes like eight hours to upload so yeah <clears throat> and plus i gotta edit this i mean i kind of edit I don't know how to edit. I just press random buttons. Well, okay. I wish I did not waste the thing. But there's always another way in Zelda. Just gotta be more creative. And I guess in this case, being creative is trying another way that's shorter. There's like this kind of, I don't know if it's really a glitch, but sometimes there's a, like these pocket things like like a little bit like that and you can gain some like that so it's basically unlimited <clears throat> just gotta find actually I think you can do it you can run up and stuff so that means if you're getting low then just do that I really need to do a lot more shrines. I think I've discovered like maybe eight more and I need to get 13 hearts. So I guess I'm gonna be focusing on hearts more than stamina. Cause I mean, the only thing that's kind of not good is the glider. Like see on that part, like if you can, you fall down. But there's like sometimes these little patches. Sometimes you can run up. Uh. All right then, I'm climbing up. 
Hopefully, I make it. Right now in the game, it's 12.35 a.m. Very late. I'm sure Link's very sleepy. For some reason, if you go inside, if you try to go inside the Lost Woods, you uh, disappear or something like that. I don't know if... Because, like, the way you do it is, like, you follow... Oh, come on. I just fell trying to do that trick. Sometimes it does not work. Like, if this does not work, then I can just go all the way down there and then climb up to here. It's always another way to do it. So I have the Legend of Zelda. You don't really have to be too much prepared other than like boss fights and stuff because even with Divine Beasts, they're still. Okay, so I don't know how I'm supposed to get that armor that makes it like me fire resistant other than like, even if I land in lava, it like takes me out, it's like water. Well, there's a shrine. <clears throat> Maybe perhaps what I can do. Oh no, fire bat. Hmm. I think you can. Okay, there's a shrine right there. I think I'm just gonna keep on eating and stuff. So, I'm going in. Oh wow. It's getting a little much more hot. Okay, I'm gonna have to switch out my weapon. Oh wow, all of them are remove. Oh wow, okay. Oh no, this was a mistake. Does the wind help? No, it does not. Okay, food. More food. Oh wow, I'm gonna be running solo on food. Okay, okay. Oh no. Oh no, I did not look at that. So I just wasted so much food. <clears throat> oh. I think what I can do is I can get into the same position, but then uh, get a fire potion. Oh, this is so annoying. Also, this video is probably going to be like 32 minutes. Um, this is like the most annoying thing. I'm going to have to go all the way down here. I'm going to have to start up basically all over just to get a stupid potion. I should have been more prepared actually because now I just wasted basically all of my food so that means I'm going to probably die more which is not good because I already die enough in this game so yeah I guess I'm going to make a potion I'm going to uh, this video is going to be 155 minutes long 155 days long uh, there's a shrine back there I should have actually just teleported to it Instead of dying, because I'm about to die. <coughs> oh, bro. You know what? Oh, wait. Here's that guy. Shakalaka, it's you again. I'm trying to get back Korok seeds, but I've lost my way. You, the folks from the stable say we're 
Chakka, that means Korok Freeze must be very near. And as long as I'm here, I may as well rest up. Ah, uh, wait a minute. And sniff sniff, I know I smell anything. A Korok seed. You've collected a Korok seed from the forest children, haven't you? I'll give you a Korok seed to increase the size. Link weapon. Shoke, I'll give you two Korok seeds for a deal. Yes. Just two. Goodbye. I'm sorry, I don't, I only have one. Okay. So, I believe what you do is, for this, I've gotten uh, this. So, uh, what I think I do is I combine it with um, something fiery, even though that is pretty fiery. Uh, let's see, I swear I collected some of those fang, those fire fangs. I guess I haven't, wait, what? I swear I collected them. Mm. Well, if you do it with monster stuff, cook, it's going to make something bad. Okay, and hasty? No, I didn't want to... Okay, so what I think I'm going to do now is I'm going to hold this and this and this. And then that's going to make fire, right? It has to make fire, right? <clears throat> oh, rest. I kind of want to see what this looks like. Or is it going to make, you know... Is it going to make... Okay, an energizing potion. I think I'm just gonna do some cooking. Well, I, I yeah, we I, we've ran out of time. This is gonna take me ten hours to upload. Well, then, any guys, anyway, guys, I'll see you guys in the next Legend of Zelda video. I'm gonna be cooking up a lot of stuff. That way, I'll be prepared for next time. And then I guess I'm gonna do a few shrines as well. I don't know. I, I'm gonna try to, this time, I'm gonna actually succeed to get inside the mountains. I just need to, you know, actually make food, so that way I survive. So anyway, I guess uh, uh, I'll see you guys.